Hi, I'm Bob Shrub, physical therapist. Brad Heineck, physical therapist. And together we have the most famous physical therapist on the internet, Brad. And our opinion, of course, Bob. It's always our opinion and we're always right. Just ask our wives. Say no more. Today we're going to talk about, we've got a, a battle going on here. Sure. We're going to go with the hurricane, the hurricane, hurry, cane, <laughs> got hurricane, it. Yeah, I get it. versus I get it. the Hugo. Hugo, all so right. So we're going to see which one is better because a lot of people are asking about these and we want to give some advice. Sure. First thing we're going to talk about is how they came. This one came like this and it had some plastic straps holding it around, sure. which is fine because I cut those. But what I also cut, not knowing because it also went around the cane, was this little wrist strap that was on there. Mm -hmm. So you don't see it here. I don't have a wrist strap anymore because I cut it. <laughs> now, maybe I'm a doofus and I probably am, but I, I got to think some other people cut that thing too because it yeah, looked like it was part yeah. of it. No, you, you, so, you got it through the mail. I, want, I don't know if they come like that in the store or not. But. Yeah, I don't know either. Good point. On this one, my criticism was, is that it was all wrapped up. It came assembled like this. It came in a big, long box. Hold on to it, Brad. Mm -hmm. But it had the, I don't know if this is the warranty or what this is. It was wrapped around it, and it was taped. And so as I was cutting through it, I'm, you know, and it, this is taped on really tight, tight in many spots. Sure. There was just no way to take it off without ripping it up. So I don't know what it is. It's probably... <laughs> Something really important. Well, we could put it together, and I guess yeah. they used to do that in World War II, <laughs> trying to get those decipher the code. Messages. That's right. So beyond that, let's go now to the canes mm -hmm. themselves. Let's. So this one is is one you can fold up, so that is an advantage. Sure. So we're gonna go ahead, and it just comes together like that, and that, then, that works pretty nice. Yeah, it works pretty nice, and uh, both of them, as you can see, have. This one has kind of a tri base, mm -hmm. and this has what they call the quad pod. Do you want to right. show that on the bottom, yeah. Brad? Four spots, this has three. Okay. The idea here is that you're hoping that it, it'll stand by itself. Right. So this one, um, the criticism is, is that it doesn't always stand right. by itself. This is carpet here, and it's standing right, well, it's short right now. You know, right. when, it's, when it's longer. Right. But I've, I put this on thicker carpet, and it fell over. Right. And my mother has one of these. And okay. uses it regularly, and that's one of her issues is she puts it down, and let's, let's just make it longer. Yeah, make it longer. Which, yeah, there it goes. And that'll happen. And this is not real thick carpet either. Uh, on the hard floor, it stands up much better. Right. Carpet, a little different. Yeah. And even a uh, wooden floor that has slats, it, it, it may go right. down on that mm -hmm. or on the ground. So okay. well, this one, my son was just showing us here. You want to show the drop test here? Yeah, I mean, we got it about an inch ahead above. Oop, that one oh. didn't make it. And it's pretty stable. If you set it down, it, it, it'll it stay. It, it's And this is as high as it'll go, which is higher than that one. By the way, one trick somebody t was telling me about online is that they do is they go like this. If they, <laughs> you know, if, they're, if it falls over, they can right. just use their foot yeah. to br bring it back up again. I don't know if this one does that. I haven't tried that. Yeah, I think you could probably work it. Not quite yeah. as easy. Oh, yeah. But it, it does it. Yep. So, so one of the criticisms of this one, Brad, was this quad pod, um, is that it, it, some people didn't like it turned that way. Right. Can you show why that would be? So if it's like this, you have a more chance of stepping on it or bumping into it with your foot as you swing your foot through or stepping on it, which caused a loss of balance. But if you look at it, it's pretty easy to turn. There's a screw at the bottom. You want to take here. it up there, Brad? Sure. Can you zoom in on this, Matt? You're going to need an Allen wrench. You're probably I, too close, Brad. I already loosened this up. How are we doing, Matt? All right. Okay. This is a really nice design, actually. It's stainless steel, and it's a taper fit, taper lock, they call it, which is used in industry a lot, and they really lock well. But you're going to need to loosen that up quite a bit, and then you're going to turn it, and it'll turn, but not real easy. And you can see, now I have it straight. And that's why we do not want it. Got all that, Matt? Okay. But I, some people complained it was difficult for them to, to handle that. Is it an Allen wrench, Brad? Yeah. I, I just got a jackknife Allen, but it's uh, just get an Allen wrench that's going to fit in there. I, I don't know what size I got. It is American. No, it's not metric. And maybe that was the problem. And, and, and you, you, you got to take it out fairly far, right? Well, not real far, actually. Um, but you got to get it loose. But when you tighten it down, don't over tighten it. Don't tighten as hard as you can because then that taper gets locked in too tight and it's harder to loosen up. You just need it snug and maybe a little more. Um, All right, then let's go to the complaint of this base, Brad. With this one, it's smaller, which, you know, 
it's less likely you're going to step on it. But if you do step on it, this is what can happen. <laughs> the cane can actually fall apart. Now, I do I, that I, again, Bob. I, I want to make sure everyone saw that. You know, because it's black on black. Oh, here. sure. But you can see it pulled away right there, yeah. and it could collapse. Yeah. And you think that, oh, that's unlikely to happen. Well, I saw on the reviews it happened to a couple people, and they fell down. Right. So that's a, a very dangerous um, feature, right. I would say, right. unfortunately. The, the other thing is um, they talked about these bolts are supposed to handle 350 pounds, but right in the restrictions here it says... Let me hear. Do you want to hold on to that for a second? I want to see the spot. Read it exactly how it says it. Because it um, not to be used. Okay, this cane is a walking aid and is not intended to absorb the full weight of the user. <laughs> so I mean, I don't know what that means. I guess you're not able. To, you're not supposed to put your full weight on it. Is what. Whereas this one. I think you can hang on that one. <laughs> yeah. Mean, it's very uh, it solid. It might be a legal thing. Who knows? Maybe, maybe it is. All right. Want to talk about the height of them? Yeah, let's talk. Well, go ahead. Is that one all the way down? Yes, all the way up. So okay. is that one. That one is too. Yep. So this one, obviously, as you can see, this one goes a little bit higher. I'm six foot six, and this is a little higher than I would probably need. Yeah. I'd, I'd probably have it a little bit lower. So how about this one? This one. It's barely, I, I would say it's on the, the li yeah. a little, maybe an inch low for so what I'd if, want. If you're six foot six or, or higher, this one's probably going to be on the short right. side or for sure too short if you're over six and foot. And how short do these things go, Brad? Are we going to try oh, that? Oh, yeah, let's shorten them up. Now, we didn't show, they both work the same way, right? They got the twist collar. Yeah, it, telescoping. There's a and collar, the and then you twist it to tighten it, yep. and twist it to loosen it, and then you got the push button. To, yeah. to hold it in place. Yep, very which identical. Is a nice adjustment. Pretty standard. Well, look at that too. I didn't even know that. Mm -hmm. So this one goes lower than this one. It goes higher than this one. So a little more variability with yeah. the height. Uh, that is pretty made. short, though. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. I'd, you'd have to be pretty on the low yeah. end to not be able to use that. So, um, let's see. What else did we want to say? The handle itself. Oh, the handles. Yeah, you want to show the handles. This, Brad? this is a nice rubber handle. Um, but this one's nicer. And the re reason I say that is because, as you can see, it's wider. It spreads out the force more of your palm. And I think most people will find this more comfortable to work with than this one. I wouldn't say this is a bad one, but this one's going to be more comfortable. Um, and this one's got the nice wrist strap screwed into the back. Um, and I guess this one's strapped on to the bottom. That's not a big deal. Some people did complain about this base getting, this, this does give away a little, a little bit in turns. Some people did complain about this uh, coming loose, and it, it does say in the instructions here, if handle or bottom base become loose, stop using cane immediately and contact Hurricane customer service. So where this one is not going to come loose, Brad, is no, it? No, that's, uh, that's locked in there well. You know, you'd have to break the plastic. All right, well, that's um, one other feature here. They contribute money to the multiple sclerosis oh, they of do. each cane. Oh, yeah. nice. And um, also, this one is what I paid anyway. I paid $24.99, mm -hmm. about 25 bucks. This was $39.95, about 40 bucks. Sure. So, Oops. There you go. <laughs> so, I guess in the end, Brad, my, my vote is, I mean, unless you have to fold your cane up for some reason, mm -hmm. I would stay away from this one, sure. to be honest with you. It's, I would go with this it's one. It's probably a better value. Better yeah. value, better uh, function, better function, safer. I really don't like this idea that if you hit this thing, yeah. I mean, that really scares me. Right, so, right. Just our opinion. Right, Brad? Yeah, it's just uh, our <laughs> opinion is right. So good luck, and uh, I think this information will help you out. And give us your opinions below. Right. Thanks.